Good afternoon to those who listen. It's June 27, 2023, 1.24 p.m. And here's a real-time map uh, of air quality. And over in my area, oh my goodness, some parts of Iowa are really bad. So right now, supposedly, it says it's uh, 2.06 in our area right now. I don't know if that's accurate or not. <clears throat> I don't know how accurate this is. <clears throat> Rock Island, Illinois, right across the river, less than five miles away from me, says 228. Remember, 250 is where it's uh, hazardous, and you shouldn't be outside at all. 236 is in Clinton, which is like 20 miles from here, and that's really close to being hazardous. 296, who's got 296? It just says Iowa. It doesn't say where. Well, that's not very smart. Nice. Parts of Illinois. Look at this. 320 hazardous. Oh, that's Wisconsin. So, yeah, it's getting serious in some of these places. Everyone needs to be on alert for sure. I mean, it's, I mean, well, over here, you know, the East Coast is actually pretty good. They're having all the storms. And then parts of Canada are really bad. Let's see if I can go back out. Was this just going to show the United States only? Or there we go. We got some Canada. Right north is on 93, 216, 217. I thought there was some more that were higher. I saw something that showed Quebec was really super bad. But yeah, right in the Midwest here, Iowa, Wisconsin, Illinois. They're the worst of the states. Everywhere else is, you know, has some effect of it, but not like the Midwest. I don't know how many people out there, if you're in the Midwest, comment on your air quality. This is really super bad. I'm having a little trouble breathing just indoors with the air conditioning on. My friend, uh, he's on the road. He's uh, one of the truck drivers. He, he was uh, over in Illinois by Peoria, and he said he could see the smoke in the air and taste it. I'm like, great. So I don't even want to go out, outside at all. But everybody just, uh, you know, be careful. Be alert to your situations. And if you have air quality that's bad, you know, limit your outdoor exposure. And if you have health conditions, you know, try not to go outdoors at all. All right, thanks for watching. God bless.